guys welcome back to world mechanics in today's video guys we'll show you how to find top dead center point uh, tdc point on uh, volvo if you have the s80 or v70 this is the t4 engine 1.6 turbo engine guys i don't know if you're familiar with it but that 1.6 turbo volvo engine actually it's a ford engine ford and mazda developed it together so that same engine is being used in ford and volvo vehicles with the t3 t4 engine now right here guys we have that ford which is identical engine to what you have most likely in your volvo and we'll show you how to set the tdc top dead center we'll be using these two right here we'll have the tools listed so check it out and this is the called a tdc pin or a top dead center pin in some cases you have to remove the drive shaft to get to it the front right drive shaft you can see ours ours is missing here now uh, this is the bracket that holds the drive shaft on the uh, to the uh, to the engine block and we removed it so we can get to that bolt now let me show you where it is okay i'm getting under the car now okay i'm ready and now right here above the oil pan there is one bolt with 10 millimeter socket we got it loose so we can remove it by hand okay that's what it looks like and we're going to place that pin in place okay perfect this is it now i'm going to show you a few things that you shouldn't do to be honest with you We'll start turning the engine clockwise, okay, but I'll place something in the spark plug hole. We'll go this way on. Do not do what I do from that point on. I'll place that too to show you how the piston will start going up. Okay, watch now. When we turn the engine clockwise, that's it. Now, up past that point, we cannot go more because it stops in that pin that we installed in the back. If we didn't have the pin, the piston will start going down. But this is top dead center point. And you will, you will try to go more. Okay, listen now, but you will stop. So you cannot, that's it. If your timing is correct, you have that, okay, that uh, dot facing up on the intake camshaft and the exhaust camshaft, you have that groove pointing up. So your Volvo engine guys will use that method. For timing, it'll be a little bit more difficult. We have to use that too, another two that will hold the flywheel through the starter hole. So we'll have the video for that as well. So uh, many more videos to come guys. Thank you for watching and see you next time.